Hey folks, this is Jay Haskamp with Frontier Precision. I'd like to show you in this video the new updates to the internet download procedure in TBC 5.32. Um, you may have seen in the release notes. Um, I know a lot of people don't read them, including myself sometimes, unfortunately, but you may have seen in there that there has been some changes to the service for um, downloading orbit data, precise orbit data through internet download, uh, which now points with version 5.32, uh, now points to a new server, which requires a login. Um, the old server is going to be obsolete on October 31st, so um, TBC 5.2 now points to the new one since it's readily available. So what you'll typically find um, in this project here, I have some static data. Uh, that I want to process and when I want to go in here and go to the IGS final orbits and hit automatic and then hit OK it'll go to the CDDIS and it'll give you an error um, that you can't log in check your username and password and that pretty much is the case for any of the um, precise orbit data you're trying to get so what you need to do moving forward is you need to go to this website here it's URS dot earthdata.nasa.gov and you'll get to this uh, login screen and this is to create a register or I should say to register and create an account for the new server so what we're going to do is we're going to hit register we're going to give it a username and put that in and Type in our information, country, United States, commercial, user type, production, and so on and so forth. So go through the um, registration information here and choose that you're not a robot and register for the login. All right, once we're registered, just gonna save that. So I've created the registration for the new server. Now what we need to do is if I wanna grab the um, final orbits, I need to go into my internet download properties and under final orbits, I wanna pick properties and then we wanna to go to the security tab. And by default, it's set to public access. What we need to do is change it to restricted access, okay? And we need to put in our, our uh, login here hit OK and OK and now I should be able to go to final orbits hit automatic hit OK and now it's connecting and I'm able to download my data okay so again that is something new uh, with TBC 5.32 again it's switching the server source um, that the ephemeris data is coming from so first you need to make sure you go to the website I'll throw it up here one more time for you is urs.earthdata.nasa.gov. Create a uh, register, create an account, and then in your, I'm just gonna import that quick, in your properties for your orbits. So if we wanted to do IGS final uh, GLONASS, we'll do it one more time. Properties, final GLONASS, uh, properties, security, restricted, username. I could type my own name, password, hit OK, OK, and now I should be able to get into my final GLONASS orbits, yep, downloading with no errors, okay? Fairly simple, just go in there, make sure you get it set up and you're ready to go and you should be able to use internet download um, as you were before, thanks.